Hey, what's going on everybody? So today we are going to make a outdoor axe throwing target out of these materials. It's not that expensive. It's all out of two by tens, two by fours, and a piece of plywood. So if you wanna see how I do it, let's get to it. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do is cut all these two by tens down to size. It's five pieces for in vertical and then two horizontal header and footer pieces. So we're gonna cut those to sides and cut the plywood and then attach them to the plywood. So before we get too far along in this build, I just want to let you know I do have plans available. I also have a file that you can cut out on your CNC that you can cut all the circles. As well in the plans, I do have a DIY template if you don't have a CNC. So if you're interested, links down below for those. The target this thing is actually very huge and massive but it's all attached back together with this plywood so I got it five pieces this way header and footer so I added that two by four over there with a clamp that way I can press all this stuff as tight to that way as possible so now that we got the two by fours on both ends to kind of press everything together. I took this, brought it back, and hit it to make sure everything is as tight as it possibly can be. Now we're going to lay the plywood on top. So to get enough two by uh, to get enough two by tens to do this whole thing, you're gonna have a piece left over. And instead of measuring and trying to mark, I'm just gonna lay this here, make me a mark. That way I can know where I need to do the screws for the inside pieces. Um, this just to me seems a little easier than. Trying to mark, mark, mark. This is just, well, I don't know about easier. You just don't have to think any doing it this way. Keep flipping it until you get where they're supposed to go. And then that one goes to the end. So that tells me where I need to do the other screw. Now that that's all on there, and I don't know if I'm gonna be able to move this bad boy. It's gonna be extremely heavy God, still gotta have a frame around it and this is pretty huge I don't even know if I'm gonna be able to put this on the CNC machine I think what I might do is Cut a, I got a bunch of quarter inch plywood left. It's cut a piece of plywood that matches the inside because that's the only where the target is. Design it up, let it cut, and then you can lay it on that and then spray where it needs to go. Here's the template. I was just gonna make like a, a long piece with holes individually and roll it like with a marker, but I don't have a marker. So we're gonna do this and we'll lay it and we'll take these different colors, spray it black, and then come back and spray, or actually spray these first, and then spray it black. I think this is easier. So I made them, they're all the right size. I'll just have to come back and hand paint just a little bit, all these little tiny pieces. I 
cut these little squares that I'm going to lay over the blue and the red ones before we lay. So I tried to use a Sharpie, didn't like that. The only paint I got that's black is in this can. So I'm gonna try to spray a bunch on here and then get the edge of this wet and then touch it like that. So I think I'm gonna let it dry for a little bit before I pick it up and move it around and add the legs to it and then it's done. So I'm not sure if this is going to work, but I'm going to try this bad boy up. And I'm going to try to use... Okay, maybe that'll hold for just a minute at least. We're going to try to attach this leg. I don't know how easy this is going to be to not drop it, but I'm going to try to line this up on the front. This needs to be even with the top like that then i think i'm gonna drive this one in first and then pivot if i got to to go down to the bottom so that one's in hold this sucker still this thing is not light at all Now let's add the other leg. finished and massive time to move it outside test it out so see ya one of these over the handers <laughs> I got it did you have the video on I think so that blue? Oh, it looks like it from here. Okay, everybody, thanks for watching this video. Uh, if you liked it, please click that thumbs up button. Also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And we just today are supposed to be getting our construction permit. So right here behind me in the next week or so, we should be breaking ground and starting the house. So I should have videos for that. If you're interested, definitely stay tuned. Click that bell so you don't miss out. But thanks for watching. I'll see y'all next time.